Isaiah Armwood made quite a name for himself last year. In his first season at GW, Armwood led GW in scoring, rebounding, dunks, and block shots. While his family, friends, and teammates know him by his nickname, they call me Zeke. He's known amongst the Colonial Army by a different moniker. In this section here, they call me the Blockness Monster. It excites me, my teammates, my coaches, and also this whole entire arena. So with that, with me able to do that, have that effect on our fans, it definitely excites me and I love the feeling of it. Expectations are high for the 100th season of GW men's basketball, and it's not just the block nest monster leading the charge. Sophomore returning starters Keith and Savage, Kevin Larson, Joe McDonald, and Patricio Garino are all back after playing significant roles as freshmen. I see them every day in practice. That's why I see the tremendous jump. So it's pressure taking off me, pressure taking off the coach. He can allow them to do things without, without having to worry about them making mistakes. Armwood and the Colonials are also expecting to benefit from the addition of newcomer Maurice Creek, who transferred to GW after a promising start at Indiana was derailed by injuries. This is where I began my basketball career and uh, now I get to finish it here. And uh, to finish my college career out here is a blessing. And I know my family members are happy that I'm home and happy to see all my games. Head coach Mike Lonergan, now in his third season in Foggy Bottom, has created a special nickname for his team's newest duo. I like the Zeke and Creek show, even though it should be called the Creek and Zeke show, but uh, I like it. Um, Mo, Mo came second, so I like the way it is. So, of course, Lonergan always got his, his little things that he liked to do. I always like the nickname the Ernie and Bernie show with uh, Ernie Grunfeld and Bernard King at University of Tennessee, so I thought about the Zeke and Creek show. Had a good rhyme to it, and I knew they'd both be great players for us this year, so uh, I was hoping that would catch on with our fans. Fans have 14 more chances to see the Zeke and Creek show in action inside the district this season, and the duo is hoping to bring out the best in each other and lead the Colonials back to prominence. We can go as far as we want to go. I don't think there's a single team in our conference that can just beat us, manhandle us, so we're going to go as far as we allow ourselves to go as far as the season goes, as long as we stay healthy. I feel like we're a top 25 team, and. Uh, the next goal is to get to the NCAA tournament and you know the final goal is to win the national championship, win the A-10 championship and win the national championship.